This video is intended to help Power Center developers who are accustomed to using source qualifiers when creating mappings understand how IICS deals with sources and targets differently than Power Center. In Power Center Designer, before you begin creating a mapping, you first use the Source Analyzer to import your sources, and then you use the Target Designer to import or create your targets. IICS does not require these initial steps before creating mappings. Instead, you can choose your sources and targets while you build your mappings. When you create a mapping from scratch in IICS, you'll notice that a single source and target are implicitly added to your mapping canvas. This is done since those are the minimum transformations required to build a valid mapping. If you are familiar with building mappings in Power Center, the first thing you probably noticed is that there is no source qualifier in the mapping, in the mapping and this SQ transformation is not in the list of transformations on the left. Instead, the source transformation is where you will find all of the settings that you are used to configuring in the source qualifier. You first choose your source connection. Then you choose if this source will represent a single object, multiple objects, or a custom query. When choosing single object, you can simply select your object, and you can preview the data. You'll also see there's a section for query options, where like in Power Center, you can specify a source filter, choose fields to sort by, and can enable select distinct. There is also a section for advanced properties where you can add pre and post SQL. When you choose multiple objects, you select one of your objects, and then you can bring in your related objects based on primary foreign key or application-specific relationships. At runtime, the source object will automatically generate the query to join these objects based on those relationships. This is a very similar behavior compared to Power Center when you connect multiple related objects to a single source qualifier. If you choose Query, you'll see a text box where you can type in a valid query that will work for your specified source connection. This is essentially the same thing as SQL override in Power Center. Configuring your targets in IICS is just like configuring sources. You choose your target connection, specify your target object, and configure your target options. That concludes this video on how IICS compares with Power Center on how it deals with sources and targets. The next video will discuss how IICS deals with the concept of transformation ports. Thanks for watching.